Greetings, everyone, along with Eddie Olchek, Stanley Cup winner with the New York Rangers in 1994. I'm Mike Emery. What a party atmosphere we have seen all day. There are people wearing inflatable Stanley Cups on tops of their heads who are also carrying brooms. There's a chance for a sweep here, but if you're the team that's the visitor and maybe being swept, how do you think about this? Well, you can't worry about the fans. You can't worry about the sausage vendors behind us. You got to worry about the team on the ice. Win the first period and go from there. And now we turn to the last lines of defense, the goalies. The playoff prize is within reach. All those dreams about being a champion could finally be realized here tonight. His team has seen success, could close this out tonight, but they can't take the pedal off the metal. They'll need to play just as hard if they want to take this one out. The centermen are in, and the puck will be dropped. With Eddie Olchek and Ray Ferraro, Mike Emmerich, and this Stanley Cup final game has begun. Let's it go. Got in the way of that one. Down near the players is Ray Ferraro. Both teams look relatively confident. If you're trying to put the championship away, you have to play with confidence, but not carelessness. And if you're trying to keep this thing alive, you have to be as aggressive as you can without being passive. Okay, Ray, thank you. Toronto's got it in their own end, hoping for center. He cut that one off in the defensive end. Great chance here, two on one. Really good job by the defenseman there. Oh, what a break. That shot hit somebody. Offensive possession here. Up to the point. Chip the Hainsey. Stole that pass at a critical end of the ice. Brody's hooked on this play, and the arm of the referee is high. Toronto's two-minute penalty is a minor, and the call is hooking. This was okay about 10 years ago. Not anymore. That's a hooking call. Calgary's power play gets its first chance in this game tonight. Uh, the numbers show if you get the first goal, you have a way better chance to win than if you're chasing the game. A power play, what a great chance here to get on the board first. Toronto's gotten it back out. They check the clock, get ready to defend. Trying to go to Bennett. The Flames skated up on the side. Slides it to the point. Laid on to Neal. He wore that puck on a hard shot. One-timer, score! Got it with the man advantage. play from in front than to chase the game. There's the game's first goal. The Flames have broken the tie. Perhaps they can build on this lead here in the first period. Calgary's got that neutral zone face off. The Flames have the puck at center ice. Snapped up that right wing to Kapanen. Shoots. Used that big goalie stick well. Backlund's a dangerous guy because he can score, but where he really gets to be a handful for the opposition is that he makes the people around him that much more dangerous. If you were playing with him, get yourself to the net, get your stick on the ice and your head up, because a lot of times the puck will be delivered right at the right time. Sightseff stripped up. That should be a penalty. The Flames are going to the box for two minutes, and the call is tripping. Oh, this is clearly a tripping call. He made no attempt to play the puck and took the legs out from the attacking player. The Maple Leafs are going to try out their power play for the first time 
of the game. Just because it's your power play doesn't mean you can take a nap here. You have to work hard and continue to generate chances. Power play time running. It's collected by Gardner. Can start the attack going in the zone. Let's it go. Say. Moving it to Ryan. Takes a perfect pass. Well, that's what your wings are for. They give it to you right in the center. And he gains the zone. Gets that pass in the corner. Cuts off that pass in the attacking zone. He got in the lane of the shot and blocked. The Maple Leafs power play let him down at a very important time. A hit that can make you mad. Ryan's off to a really aggressive start. He gets a solid lick in as he tries to set the tone for his team physically. Has it picked up. And now it's directed to Johnson. Skates it into the zone. Shoots. Terrific point blank save. The shooter thought he had a chance, but the goaltender robs him. What a stop. Good intercept by Johnson. Couldn't get through. It's loose. And he's held up. Popped out of the scrum by a skate. Malamaki's tripped, and a penalty should be coming. Toronto sent to the box for two minutes. It's tripped. This is an easy call for the official, Doc. The player made no attempt to play the puck and just tripped up the attacking player. Calgary's to the power play again. And they have rung in one already. Let's see if they get another. I like their setup on the power play that scored earlier, Doc. Let's see if they can get it set up again. Move the penalty killers around for a couple of good chances. Mishandled thanks to the roadblock. Very important if he can clear this puck out. The Maple Leafs shoot it back out. Got some time to check the clock and prepare to defend again. Calgary's in possession in their own end. Canes that offensive line. Shoots one. Swept aside. And ring more bells on that one. One after another. The Leafs have us back at full strength because the penalty has been killed. Cut that pass in his own end. Just great positional play. Pass attempt to Levo. Great stick work prevents the pass from being complete. And a save. He froze that just for a break. Great job by the goalie here. Lots of buzzing in his own, but he gets the stop and he'll settle things down. Just over seven minutes to go here in the first. The Flames lead 1-0. They win the draw. What next? Skill play by John Tavares. From the outside. Just fired it wide. That was a decent chance, but he just missed the net. A one-timer! Outstanding save there! Passing one off now to Marner. Has that one measured at center. Puck loose, denied by the defense. Cut off that pass at center ice. And angled to Hennepin. A textbook stick save. Loose puck knocked away by Backlund. Pitching it to Marner. Driving in from no man's land. Many yards gained to Dermott. Great opportunity, but the pass didn't connect. Opted for a fake out, but can't seem to make a move. Points it. The stick can break up a play, and it just did. Takes that pass and looks on. Gathered up by Hammonick. Into the corner by Johnson. Puck is thrown to Froelich. Gains the zone. Slid to Hannafin. Terrific opportunity, but a missed pass, and so they have to drop back. And worked up the wing to Neal. And he dumps it in. Snapping a pass to Brown. Good use of the stick. Broke that pass up. What a tremendous hit. One way to wear down your opponent. Play physical. That's exactly what happened there. Directing that one to Lindholm. 
crosses that line. Hangs on to it in the corner. Tremendous job done defensively there with a poke check. Looking to Monaghan. First period has been played. An interesting start to all of this. Continuation in just a moment. Only one goal scored and two periods yet to go. Are you looking to impress at your next group of The Flames have a one goal lead. This is the one that did it for them as the teams are in the locker rooms and we're about to sell some. Your seat in one of our extravagant luxury boxes. See our website for details. be like the first one. No, that pass escaped back over the blue line, so everyone has to get back. Nice play with the stick. Nothing more will come. The Flames move to center ice. Got it at the point. Good defensive read with that one. Pitching this one to Hyman. Got that pass in his own end. Side to side they go, trying to generate something. Reads the play and keeps it. Propelled to Goudreau. Trying to go to Monaghan. Shot on. Handled with the stick. That one is pointed to him. Oh, he had a great chance to shoot there, and he did, but it was answered by the glove. Calgary's got it again. And off target with that one. Wicked shot there. That's why I wasn't a goalie, Doc. Able to attack now. Skilled play by Backlund. The Flames skated up on the side. Good place to shoot from, and he does. Block that one. And holds on to that puck to get the whistle. Solid clean win. Moving it to Matthews. And now it's directed to Marlowe. He's got that point pass. To Froli. Pass attempt to Hamonic. Oh, what a hit that one was. Well, he's been looking for that hit all night. The Maple Leafs up the wing, lock the puck. Puck loose, good defensive play. Marlowe's hooked on the play. There will be a penalty. Calgary's roster goes down by one here. At least briefly, a minor penalty for hooking. The referees are looking for this. Anytime you stop skating and reach with your stick and pull on the opponent, you're going to the penalty box. Toronto's power play gets another chance to operate. Hasn't been effective yet. After an ineffective power play earlier in the game, Michael let's see if they can get a little more organized in the puck into the zone and get it on net far more frequently. He finally got it out of there. Scooped up by Gardner. Toronto's skating in their own end, trying to get to the neutral zone. On to Marlowe. Rister from the slot. Oh, stick save. And that one goes back down. A tremendous job of penalty killing by Calgary. Carries it on in from center. Toronto's power play could have made a big difference, but did not. Passing one off now to Ryan. Takes a shot. A strong pad stop there. He kicked it along out of the scrum. Good intercept in his own end. Got it in his own end. The dump in clears the defense. Around through the corner. Fires a shot. Save! 
Santos in their own end and controlling the play. Nice stick by the defense. Outstanding body contact. Better tighten up the brain bucket. Not afraid to get physical here tonight. Calgary's in their own end and shifting gears. Chip to Levo. Waits from the corner. He's got that one. You couldn't diagram it better on a chalkboard. Perfect pass. Stole that pass away in his own end. They've been so responsible with the puck most of the night. It's plays like that that they just haven't made. This isn't the time to start being risky. Good job defensively done there. That takes some pressure off with that defensive play. Slick move to continue forward. Hangs on to that one for a stoppage in play. Calgary's goaltender's got to keep himself sharp. He has not faced many shots, and he can't be unaware when one finally gets directed his way. They won that draw. To the point it comes. To Hyman. Laid on to Tavares. Read that play in his own end. Steps in from the neutral zone. Brings a shot. Toronto's carrying it in the defensive zone. Slid the Hainsey. Caught his pad on that one. And decides to just hold on and get a stoppage of play. Just a bit under five minutes left to go in the period. It's a 1-0 game. The Leafs win it. Enormous hit. Riley's often the object of a target. He's so good, nobody wants to give him much room. But he gets tagged there. Let's it go. Can't get it on net. Pitching it to Gardner. Buck is thrown to Kapanen. to the corner. Cut that pass in his own end. Propelled to Hyman. Picked up in the attacking zone. Pucks loose, denied by the roadblock. It'll come free, but not without a lot of work. Collected by Neal. In with it now. Let's it go. Great save. And freezes play for the whistle. Calgary's aggressive forechecking has been a key to this period. Every time their opponent has the puck, they get a body on them, and as a result, they've scored goals to take the lead. Quick work on the faceoff. Lots on that to Hamonic. The Leafs lug the puck in the defensive zone. Got that pass near the blue line and now looks ahead. This is tiring late. The drama heightens in this final minute of the second period. Steps across that line. Decides he wants the corner. And at an angle to Dermott. Good save there. Couldn't get his way through. Trying to get it back out of the zone. Two periods have been played. And so, as we think back through the first two, we think ahead toward the third. We take a look at the shots on goal through two periods. 15 for Calgary and 7 for Toronto. Calgary's netminder has fashioned a goose egg on the opposition side of the scoreboard. At the end of this period, we are still thinking about the last huge save, which was this one, right back after this. What are you waiting for? Join our Insiders Club today.
40 minutes down, at least 20 minutes to go. What are your thoughts so far? The Flames have been the better team, Doc, through two periods of play. They're up by one as we get ready to start the third, but it could be more with the chances that they've had through the first 40 minutes. Is able to move on in. Puts one on. Turned away with the stick. Very important steal for him. Receives that pass from the other side. Backhander to the net. Got in the way of that one. The Flames with possession in the neutral zone. Snapping a pass to Hyman. Using the point. Gets the pass through to start a play. On to Marner. Back to the backhand. A superb hit. A great hockey play there. I once had a coach tell me, hit or be hit. There's an example of getting yourself into the game. Wonderful chance was set up, and the pass just goes wide. And he steps across the line. Got that pass in his own end. It's deflected. Blockered away. Loose puck blocked off by Backlund. Picked up behind the net. Strength and support by the Flames. Toronto's carrying it in the defensive zone. Loose pocket went off somewhere. Leads that charge into the zone. Muscled off. Nice work by Marlowe. With a drive. He missed the net. If they move the net into the corner, maybe that hard shot's got a chance to be dangerous. Let's it go. Wonderful stop. Makes the stop and holds for the whistle. Anderson's save rings of desperation here. That shot changed direction, and he had to get back to make the save. Just under six minutes have been skated so far. Only one goal hanging on the board so far. So it's 1-0. A point blast. Well done with that pass. Directing that one to Kadri. And he steps in. In that defensive zone, an important play. Alone. Quick shot. Tay. Play stopped. That puck is just held. That's not really a scoring chance. It's a puck to the net. The goalie gets to handle it and stop it, but not a challenging stop at all. Face off and a solid tie up and help arrive. Good job. Took that away in his own zone. Chip to Cotri. Lawful boarding. Important interception there. Nicely into the zone. Gives it to the point. That's a great deflection there. Good stick. Has that pass off the boards. Score! This is one shot I wish more young hockey players would use. Everybody wants to take the big slapper. It's not how hard you shoot it, it's how quick it comes off your stick. And that was quick. Well, the goalie shakes his head, turns around and sees the puck behind him. He can't believe he got beat low on the stick side again. They've got the draw. By number 67. Toronto is controlling play now up the wing. Lost the puck, just couldn't get by. Calgary's back at its own end, trying to work forward. It's dumped in. Has it back deep. Looking to Ennis. Cuts that pass off. Directed on. Pad save. 
steals it in the attacking zone. Recollects it. Fires! That shot came from right in front. Now that's a solid save. Cut controlled now by the defense. Heads on to the corner. Pitching this one to Stone. Calgary's goalie has been like an acrobat tonight. He has made several great stops in protecting his shutout. See if they can bring it home. Taken behind by Bennett. Oh, and he has closed off emphatically. He didn't leave much in the bag as he went right through and crushes him into the boards. Takes that pass. Glides along the line. A shot, gets it with the blocker. Trying to go to Valamaki. This is a tough one to work with. Advanced by this gate. That puck left the zone, and so everybody will have to reset. Laid on to Hannafin. Shoots, nearly grazed the iron on that. When the puck sounds hard when it hits the end boards, that means you've missed the net. Scoring chances handed away. A shot. You can almost count that one, but no, what a save. Calgary's really taken the air out of the game defensively, Doc. Their goaltender hasn't had much to do, but he stopped the shots that he's had to. A one-timer. Terrific shot blocking the lane. Oh, the pass just didn't work. Look out. Here it goes. Oh, that's a great hit. He's trying to spark his team in a comeback here as they try to get within striking distance. Off a defender, that's a free puck. The Maple Leafs with a neutral zone possession along the wing. Intercepts that pass. Maybe he can generate something. Tavares tries to force this puck into an area that it just won't go. Sometimes you have to live to fight another day. That wasn't a time to take a chance. Did not get anything up. Slid to Johnson. Really good cut of the pass. Calgary shifting gears as they travel through center ice. Fires! Terrific challenge, outstanding save. Now that's a beautiful stop on a great scoring chance. Hung right over him and couldn't get it past. Smith's playing net better than anyone right now. He's doing whatever it takes to keep the puck out of the net. We are in the 60th minute out of 60. Shoot! Oh, that one hit someone on the way. Moving into Hainsey. Toronto's in the neutral zone along the way. The Maple Leafs have to take a chance here. They pull their goalie. He helps his team make progress with that bounce pass. I like that play. He had a little bit more of a risky option, but he went off the boards and bounced it safely to his partner. Blocked. And now it's directed to Brody. Oh, that's more than your normal rub out. This is what you call a great body check. Legal along those boards. Sends it across the blue line. Shoots it. Big bad save. Ten seconds to go. Pass attempt to Monaghan. Propelled to Lindholm. Net empty. They have survived for another day. It is three games to one now in the best of seven. Doc, I think we all had our doubts, but they've been able to get a win. They're deep in the trenches, but they're not out of it yet. And so ends another playoff contest and telecast. We hope you'll be watching for our next one. For Eddie Olchek and Ray Ferraro, Mike Emmerich saying good night.